this video I'm going to show you my favorite essential oils specifically for stress. This is the diffuser I am currently using. It is from Art Naturals and it kind of looks like a little wooden turnip. I think it's absolutely adorable. Now I have a different diffuser that's much smaller that I have to refill really frequently. So that one is kind of difficult because I have to keep an eye on it and make sure it's not empty. And this one is just way more practical for what I'm usually using it for because I can put a lot more water in this one. It can run for a lot longer and it has a whole bunch of really cool features. So on the front of this, you can set up the light. Now it has several different light settings. You can push the button once and it will start the light cycling through several different colors. Or you can push it again, it will do one solid color. And if you push it a third time, it will turn it off. So now I have it cycling through all of the colors. It might be a little bit hard to see with my ring light on, but right now it's cycling from green and then to blue. And especially when you have this in a darkened room, it's really pretty. It has a clock on the front, so you can set the clock with this button. You can set an alarm with this button. This button controls your mist, and I'll show you how that works. You just push it once, and you can set it up to do different timers. So if you just press it once, it continually stays on. If you press it again, this little light moves over to one hour again three hours and again six hours so you can set it up on a timer and it will just automatically turn off when it's done so if you wanted to do this before bed you could just turn it on and set it to one hour and it would be just enough for you to relax and calm down and soothe you into sleep and then you don't have to worry about waking up to turn it off so it has a really nice strong mist as you can see and right now I have some lemongrass in it. Another fantastic thing about this particular oil diffuser that I don't think I've seen on any others is it also is Bluetooth enabled. So it's a Bluetooth speaker. It does everything. So I'll just show you all the essential oils that I got from Art Naturals. This is their Essential 8 kit and it comes with all of these oils. Rosemary, sweet orange, lemongrass, frankincense, tea tree, peppermint, eucalyptus, and lavender. And of course those are really basic um, popular essential oils, especially lavender. Now, I love to diffuse essential oils, but I'm always really careful about making sure people realize that essential oils need to be taken seriously. So I don't like to overuse essential oils, one, because of the environmental impact. They take quite a lot of the plant that they need to manufacture them, and also because of the risk of sensitization, which is overexposure, can basically cause you to become allergic to an essential oil. So you need to be really careful about how much you use, and always follow the instructions on your diffuser that come from the manufacturer. So I've got this big huge diffuser, it's full of water, and I only put five drops of lemongrass in it. And that is pretty much the maximum I'll ever use. There are also some essential oils that are not safe for cats because cats lack quite a few of the enzymes that humans have, so they're not able to metabolize things the same way. So a lot of essential oils that I love, I will not diffuse if my cats are going to be in the room because there's too great of a risk that it will get on their paws or their fur and they'll lick it up and it could actually make them very sick. So you have to be careful of those things and just do a little bit of research. It's a quick Google search to make sure that you're using essential oils that are safe for you, your pets, or if you have small children. Now if I'm using essential oils directly on my skin, I will always dilute them with a carrier oil. Now I don't necessarily want to pre-mix it with the carrier oil because then I need a separate container to keep it in, but one thing you can do is use an oil like this, which is this um, Jason brand vitamin E oil, and you just put a little bit on your skin. So I'll put some right there on my pulse point. I rub it together between my wrists and then I take the essential oil I'm going to use and I just brush the cap against that little area. I don't even put a full drop on there, just enough to get that essential oil onto the carrier oil and then I mix them together. and. I get all of the benefits of that fragrance. And this not only protects your skin, but it also makes sure you're not using too much of your essential oil, and it helps protect you from becoming sensitized to your favorite essential oils, which can be a huge bummer. So right now I actually have a little bit of a sinus infection, and that's part of the reason that I'm using lemongrass. So lemongrass is really fantastic for warding off infections, especially if you're diffusing it, getting it into your lungs and your sinuses. It's gonna help you beat a cold or any kind of congestion because it's just helpful 
helping you heal faster. But aside from that, lemongrass is one of my go-tos to relax. It really helps clear your mind and it's just a really uplifting, fresh, summery, clean scent. Another great thing about this diffuser is if you have an outdoor eating space, you could put this diffuser on your table in the middle, put a little bit of lemongrass in there, and lemongrass will actually ward off insects. Another favorite of mine for reducing stress is frankincense. Now, frankincense is made from a resin or a tree sap, so it's similar to amber. If you're familiar with amber, it's a really woodsy, rich aroma. And I think part of the reason I like frankincense so much is because it is one of the ingredients in the thurible in the Episcopal church so it kind of takes me back to my youth being an acolyte you know swinging that flaming smoking thing around the church so that's pretty fun lavender is another one of my favorites for stress because it's so relaxing and it just gives me this overall feeling of well-being lavender is a really popular scent and part of the reason for that is because it's so relaxing so it's very common in massage oils and diffusers in common areas where people aren't necessarily used to smelling essential oils all the time Right now I'm using a linen spray that I made with my lavender essential oil and this is just four parts distilled water, which is important because distilled water won't allow bacteria growth, one part of vodka, and this bottle holds a little bit under one cup of water so I added about eight to ten drops of lavender essential oil and I just shake it up before each use and then spray it onto my linens and it gives this really nice relaxing mist that helps soothe me to sleep. So those are my favorite oils specifically that are relaxing. Now there are a bunch of other oils in this kit, so I'm just gonna go over a few of them briefly. Eucalyptus is also a really fantastic one if you're feeling under the weather. What I like to do with this is put two or three drops in the bottom of a really hot shower and allow it to steam up and that will release the eucalyptus and it's really great for helping to clear your sinuses. Now if you're familiar with Vicks VapoRub, that has camphor in it which creates a really similar cooling effect in your sinuses, but eucalyptus essential oil is so much safer than Vicks VapoRub. VapoRub, while I love it and it feels great, it can be really, really toxic, especially for infants. Sweet orange oil is another one that comes in this kit that I love. This one is really uplifting and sort of clears negative energy and just puts you in a really positive headspace. Another great thing about this one is that spiders hate it, so I mix a couple of drops of this with some clove essential oil and put that in another bottle that has either water or witch hazel or something like that to dilute it and spray it around my windowsills and then those creepy crawlies won't be coming inside. Tea tree oil is fantastic. It's antibacterial, antimicrobial, and antifungal. So it's really fantastic for a lot of uses. You can use it in cleaning. And this is another one that's really uplifting and sort of astringent feeling. For me, this is always a surefire way to kill a pimple in 24 hours. I just mix it with a tiny bit of vitamin E oil dab it on any blemishes and they dry up the next day. Peppermint I absolutely love. Now this isn't one that I necessarily use for relaxing because it is more energizing and uplifting and this brand's peppermint is more on the candied sugary side. There are several different types of peppermint essential oils but this one is really sweet and uplifting and I absolutely love this one. This is also a really good one for helping to clear your sinuses and airways. And the last one in the kit is rosemary. This one I absolutely love mixing together with lavender in a bath bomb or something like that. It is a little bit more on the foodie side when it's on its own, but it's really great for helping you focus, improving your memory, and keeping you awake and energized. So those are the essential oils that are helping me survive these stressful times. I'm actually in the middle of packing up my entire apartment to move this weekend. And what I love about this device is that it's just everything combined in one. If you want to check out any of these products that I have shown you, there will be a link in the description below, as well as a coupon code for 20% off your entire purchase. If you want to see more videos about essential oils like this one and the different benefits of them, or even several recipes that include essential oils, let me know in the comments below. If you're not already subscribed, please hit that subscribe button, hit the notification bell next to it so you get updates when I post new videos. Follow me on social media at Katrinaocity, check out my podcast at mdxpods.com, and if you enjoyed this video, please click the like button. It really helps my videos get seen. Mm -hmm.